specific strides have you made? Um, just you know, making the switch from D tackle. I played uh, defensive end my freshman year. Um, just improving from last season, just you know, technique wise, you know, some of things. How much did you know, the injury situation last year, especially with the defensive line, affect your expectations for the year and what you kind of learned about yourself as a player? I mean, definitely uh, adversity hit, and um, I think we we did what we could to um, you know combat that. But I think even now. Um, it's just we have that mentality, it's, it's changing. So I think it's going to be a great season. Last season, the team was up, I think, seven times in the second half. Mm -hmm. How does this team kind of learn to finish those games this year? How do you learn from that? Um, I mean, just based on our experience, I mean, we've been working uh, to create, you know, a different uh, mentality in practice, always just finishing tackles, finishing blocks, whatever, just competing every day. When you look at film of your individual play last season, what was an area or two that you grew the most? Um, I'd say my steps. Uh, switching from DN to D tackle is, is a little bit different. And uh, I think now I'm, I'm a little bit better at my steps and uh, taking on those double team and scoop blocks. And with that in mind, what couple of things have been a personal point of emphasis for you this spring? Um, just to keep making strides with uh, all the rest of the technique that comes with it. Um, just hand placement, uh, like I said before, footsteps, my hips, uh, working on pass rush, transition pass rushing, things like that. Going back to the, the, foot, the footwork, is that maybe the most difficult transition initially when you got here, or what, uh, what was it for you? Yeah, it definitely was that. Um, I mean, last spring, I, I was working on it from the spring all through the summer, through the season, you know, try to get better at it, and I'm finally, finally making strides for do you, it. Do you have a moment you remember in a game or a sequence, or maybe it was game film from a specific game that you realized, you know what, I think I've got this now, I'm on a good place here. Uh, I think Miami. Miami is the first game where I started to feel like, okay, I, I think I got it now. Did you add weight with the position change? Uh, yeah. I mean, I struggled a little bit in the season. I hovered around 2, 264, 265, but now I'm up to like 275. So. How's that? Have, have you felt that change? Uh, just a little bit, but I, I'm not feeling it no more. Yeah, I'm looking to be about 285 by training. And how do you get to 285 while maintaining you know, the conditioning and all the other stuff? Uh, just extra work, uh, just eating, eating all the time around the clock. Uh, Are you eating something different now than maybe you were before? A uh, little, little, uh, a lot of red dots, a lot of red dots. Really? Um, yeah, and just, you know, a little extra condition afterwards and, uh, and the Rams head deck. So, yeah. Thanks, appreciate it.